big news today. It's no longer the Team 10 house. It's now the A-Team house. So let me introduce you to the team. A man named Lucas. A painter named Dirks. And a mysterious fella named Chappie. And don't forget my man on the camera, Garen Chadwick. Guys, that's the team, hashtag A-Team, and we are the strongest crew on YouTube. Back. Guys, it's a big day. Lots of stuff happening. Uh, first of all, just throwing everyone's clothes. They were left behind out into the dumpster out there. All this stuff's gonna change. The JP merch store, we gotta change it to the A team. But since we're the ones that build and do all this stuff anyway, it shouldn't be that difficult to do. Redecorating, remodeling, and just, you know, assimilating the crew. By the way, which brings up the fact that if you're following this channel and you were previously following Jake's channel, you know what to do. Back there, subscribe button. Join the A team, ring the bell, ring the bell. Yeah, get an invitation to the party. Every day of my life's a party, bro, including holding down this fort. Because now the team 10 is they seen team team 10 is they seen let's go change everything attention attention team 10 is now the 18 dude in fact like, <laughs> they don't know how to do that we changed everything we changed the <laughs> wi-fi password changed the locks on the doors we changed the salary payroll for all the employees is now it's now the, the a team house fact let's go i'm just gonna keep calling him for the answers i'm trying to get my barber to fly out from vegas Look at you, bro. It's getting worse. I can't even, sh I'm, I'm embarrassed right now. This is now. a house full of unfresh. Barbara, you pick up the phone, bro. I'm not gonna stop calling. Please you leave your phone. message. She's gonna call. Come here, it's precious. Yo. Yo, yo. Yo, what are you doing right now? Oh, here on the rooftop. Cut hair. Where, what city are you in? I'm in Texas. What are you doing you know? in Texas? I'm cutting, they flew me in. Who flew you in? Who's they? Yo, why do you why do you have my barber? I gotta fly him to LA. I'm sorry, I gotta take him right now. <laughs> you good? You good to go? You good to go, baby? Yo, and I'm building you a barber shop inside the Team Ten House. You heard that? I like that. Oh, it's on. Hey, I like. I was just telling my boys about you just now. The latest vlog on YouTube. Mm. Easy, yeah. yeah. easy. Remember, if you stay lit, you don't gotta get lit. <laughs> It's all facts. Yo, can you go get on a plane right now to uh, LA? I'm gonna look up flights, see what I can do. No, I'm we, no, I, I'll, I'll just send the plane for you right now. No problem, I'm there. All right, just text me what airport to send it to. Uh, find out where the clear port is, I'm sending it right now. Got you. All right, for sure. All right, dude, I know you got big plans. Tell me what's going on in the merch room. First things first, that's gonna work. That's gonna work just nicely, okay? Second thing second, boom, Luke's face, Dirk's face. Your face. I think I also need to put my face here. Okay, Logan stays. That's the homie. Ah, all these stickers, gotta change. All your this face. merch, A team stuff. Graffiti match. What about the everyday bro? It is everyday bro that can stay. We're gonna need to call a neon sign guy. That one can stay. That one's gonna go. Fire backpacks, super fire. Change the name. <laughs> change the name. Gonna be huge. It's gonna be the hottest backpack ever. Same design, different name. Same mansion. New owner, it's gonna be big. Okay, look, Garrett, here's yeah. the deal, yeah. man. It's a big deal, we're gonna get swollen here, okay? But, it's no longer Team 10. We're gonna have to change this to 18. All we gotta do, white out the 10, add an A. Boom! Easy solution. See my face down there? We'll put my face there and his face there. <laughs> I think it's the only thing I need. <laughs> put Luke's face where Chad the Hitman Tepper is. Garrett, are you feeling strong? You gonna be up there, bud? Bro, I'm feeling real strong. Okay, all right, cool. Yeah. I think it's shaking of shake and bake. It should say, trust me on this, I'm chubby. Well, hello. <laughs> so Dirks is going here. All you have to do is add a mustache. <laughs> <laughs> the game room's pretty much cool, except instead of frosty and saucy, it should maybe be like spanky and hanky. Who do you think, hanky and panky or not? Nah? <laughs> hanky and panky or not? Nah? Nah. <laughs> You're a All right, this is like the jump rope, right? Get in here. <laughs> so yeah, bro, so I wanna like put all lava lamps in here. I feel like it'd be a good chill room for me, you know? Yeah. Like, all these ideas I had for Jake, 
it's like, now I get to rethink like, what would I like? And what would I be into? Because like, bro, even look at these these stripes I put by the couch, I just thought this would be really dope. But, hey Jake. How did you get in here? Where? Uh, in my house? No, I live here, yeah, it's my house. I walked in the door. Damn it! Is the house next door for Sam? Honestly? I think it is. You <laughs> out. <laughs> Jay came up with this idea today. I can't even take credit for it. He's looking at the couch and he was like, yo, what if we had like pointy racing stripes going up? I'm, I'm about to throw something out there. What if we got this reupholstered to go like that? <laughs> I feel like we have to do it. Is that a West Coast Customs? It call? is, yeah, it Actually? is, yeah. Yo, I feel bad. They literally have like nine of my cars right now. I don't even have nine cars. <laughs> do we need a rug as well? Does the rug have to do the same thing too? Honestly, if the rug did it, bro, like, people would walk in here and faint. <laughs> <laughs> Get an aneurysm. Like, I'm not even doing it. They'd be like, what is that? Speaking of everyday bro, I've been taking the Ed Fluence classes that Jake has online and I've seen some mixed reviews, but let me tell you, I, I'm in the house with him every day and he doesn't tell me as much as I learned on his courses. A lot of tips and tricks in there that's worth the money. So if you guys are trying to do the social media thing, I get a lot of messages asking me to help you get to where I'm at and I'm nowhere, really, but I'm learning a lot of stuff in there that, you know, we should check out. Thanks, buddy. Bro, you're kind of like the case study if you think about it. Hey, Erica. Hey. Hey. Looks great. Thanks. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Guys, basically what did we learn today? That this isn't my house. That was my first lesson. <laughs> so there's no hate involved here. I actually was just having fun with my boys since they were snowed in for a day. We had to pretend like it was our crib. But I want to talk a little bit about not being a hater, right? Because I'm not a hater. I'm a congratulator. Yo, my man just turned 21. 7.4 million dollar mansion. Hustle hard. Go after what you want. Work every day. This kid, I see it. Y'all see what's on vlog. He gets up seven in the morning, he's planning out the vlog, what he wants to do, having meetings in between that, all this off camera stuff, curating a clothing line, doing marketing on all levels, then trying to educate people with the effluence thing. Yo, so many things I can't even talk. Other projects that y'all don't see. Really inspiring dude. That's what I want you guys to take away from today's vlog, is although we're having fun in games, yo, take pride in what's yours. I take pride in the fact that like this ain't mine, but I get to help this man live his dream. Like, he's a creative dude, I get to be creative, we get to do out of the box ideas, we get to put something special together here. Like, this isn't your normal house, and it's not your normal mansion. It's the Team Tim Mansion, and it's the Taj Mahal. And at the end of the day, by the time we're done here, it's just gonna be the most unique crib that you've ever walked into, right? Because everything is being custom built, custom designed, custom painted for this guy, because he has a vision, and he makes it his own. We do the same thing at home. Nobody tells us how to live. We find our own way, and we see our reality. So you, watching, I want you to know that, whether it's art, whether it's business, whether it's being a doctor. And I always like to say, like when I was a kid, I wanted to make music, I wanted to be creative, I wanted to be an actor, I wanted to host events and parties. That's what I do. If you gave me $100 million right now, and said our money, what would you do every day? I'd be doing what I'm doing. Just do the best job that you can do. Study hard, work hard, go after everything that you got. Don't listen to nobody unless it's positivity because a lot of people don't want to see you win. But today was a talkie vlog, that's a fact. But you know, a lot of people have been asking me like, yo Armani, how'd you make it? how do you do it? How did you get so rich? Yo, there's really nothing to it. I've been up and I've been down a few times, right? But no matter what happens, I do things I like to do. Hosting events, painting mansions, building stuff, being creative finding a way to make money off of doing those things. So I never feel like I'm working. And there's bumps along the way, nothing's perfect. Don't let me smile and scream and make you think that everything's perfect, right? Because life's not always perfect. You don't have your bad days. You have your depressed days. You're gonna have the days where people are giving you shit for no reason. Maybe they was having a bad day and it wasn't your fault, you know? So just don't let that affect you too much and try and power through all that negativity because only 10% of the world is always positive. And I wanna to try to be part of that 10% to infect the other 90% that maybe having to frown to turn it upside down. Anyway guys, we got a lot more coming over here at the mansion and all I'm trying to do is keep you in the loop.
Is that how things work, Michelle? Honestly, I think it is. <laughs> 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 <laughs>